peace what's going on guys it's your boy serrano welcome back to the channel and i wanted to share with you my trip to new orleans now it's the first time i've ever been in new orleans and i don't really get to travel that much throughout the whole year but i definitely wanted to share my trip with you because these shots that i got on the redmi note 8 pro and the honor 9x pro were actually just ridiculous man um now I always get the window seat or at least I try to on a plane so when I do I try to catch some 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 uh, like views so I wanted to share the view that I was seeing when I was like well let's let's catch let's take flight right now let's take flight and in all honesty this is actually my favorite part about a plane ride is the takeoff I love that that um, how the gravity hits you and then you you kind of like Feel your ears pop when you hit a certain altitude but i did have my earphones in the airpod pros which actually worked like earplugs so i never got that pressure building up in my ears because like those plugs were in which was pretty sick I, I definitely like uh flying it's definitely really relaxing for me but most of the time i'll be like sleep on the plane and everything but when we got off the plane um I was actually wearing my AirPod Pros the whole time, so I didn't hear a sound. Someone was saying that there was a cat meowing on the plane, which I didn't hear whatsoever because I had these things cranking the whole the whole entire time. And they did sound like really good, those AirPod Pro clones that I was using. And I did review them, so make sure you check that video out. I'll leave a, a little click thing at the top so you can see that video. But um, yeah, the we were greeted with this beautiful landmark which I was able to capture multiple different lenses. And you can see this is the ultra wide one. And um, they, they did have some some interesting culture and, um, you know, like landmarks just to say the least. But uh, my Redmi Note 8 Pro was doing a really good job capturing some, some really good detail um, when it came to the images that it was taking. Now, when they, when they use that 64 megapixel camera, they are, you know, uh, combining multiple different photos together to get that end result through software. So, you know, that's pretty much how they were able to achieve it. And Xiaomi definitely has their act together and their game on up to par when it comes to competing with older flagships, such as like Samsung's Note and S lineups, maybe the eight and down. I, I would say that the Note 8, uh, the Redmi Note 8 uh, Pro from Redmi is almost comparable to like an older Samsung flagship phone when it comes to the cameras because they've actually put a lot of work into their software. Now, I could almost say that the Honor 9X Pro is one of the best, um, you know, cameras for the price. Now, keep in mind, this phone is only 250 you know what I mean? Like, that's really a low, that's a really low price. But for the high quality that you're getting, it just doesn't, it's it's stupid not to take a look at this device and not to um, check it out. But um, you can see the quality that I was getting, just beautiful, those clouds. When I got into the ultra wide, I was getting a nice uh, guys, see the camera? This guy, you Sorry, see, sir. this is the guy's hustle. Thing you got, and it's the sign right deck here. So, Security there's a lot of hustlers when you guys in this town, just like New York. Everybody's got a hustle. <laughs> And, um, you know, it's very comparable in that sense. It's a hustler town. Everybody's trying to break bread and stuff like that, too. But um, we're on Bourbon Street right here, just taking in the environment. So just enjoy this little quick snippet.
So I hope you enjoyed that. I mean, I really enjoyed it in person. Wow. I really enjoyed the environment that I was in, the culture, the food, the music, the um and then I brought my best cameras that I think would perform really good for this trip, which which was the Honor 9X Pro and my Jami Redmi Note 8 Pro at the time. And um I got to say they do look good. The Honor 9X Pro looks really good. The Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 Pro performed well. And this was like a little outdoor art um, plaza. And I mean, these guys had some talent, man. Everybody was hustling. Everybody was grinding. This kid was like just painting his ass off. He was really talented too. And just a whole lot of um, things to check out. The food, um, the bevs. Um, Right here, I was actually trying out some shrimp and grits, which was just like to die for. Not literally, but just like it was really good. You know what I mean? Just the saying. And then um, I did try out the, um, what is it? The alligator or the um, crocodile or whatever it is. The, the gator. Uh, somehow we managed to score some free tickets to uh, like a show that I never went to, but it was cool. Um, here's the po' boy um, shrimp, I believe it was, sandwich. And then, like, we were drinking the whole entire time, man. No breaks in between, 100%. Um, but we got some more music. Ultimately, I just had a dope time out here, man. Um, can't wait to go back. Met some cool people, too. Um, you know, and it's just a really good environment. You definitely want to bring your best cameras possible. Oh, point to um, it again? Creole House. Oh. Right there. Yeah, that so, sounds dope. Yeah, we in there. Which, um, in, in my case right here, it would be the nine, Honor 9X Pro and Xiaomi yeah, Redmi Pro. I don't really yeah. review mo much flagship phones unless they're older models from um, a few years back because um, we believe here on the channel that uh, you shouldn't have to pay over 300 or more, maybe 400 tops, but you shouldn't have to pay um, over $400 for a really good phone. So that's why on this Yo, channel you will see yeah. reviews of phones and different electronics that aren't going to um cost you like an arm and a leg and and break your 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 bank account for like a couple of months in a row um i'm here to look out for you guys and provide you with the best possible um options in the budget and mid-tier uh, price point but you can see right here that fire mixed with water was in slow motion <laughs> that was like i was stuck on that for a minute and then this chick was doing the um hit the hit the something dance so she was like actually hitting this dude 
hit the doggy i think it's called or hit the i don't know let me know down below what that song is called oh snap i just remembered it was called hit the quan or something so i turned off the music because i didn't want to get a copyright because like there's a lot of like music in this city a lot of music uh really good music and, uh, a lot of um positive energy as well but um the Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 Pro between both of these two cameras did, um, in my opinion, did have a less fuzziness um, overall in nighttime, which I did observe. So um, when it comes to these two cameras, um, I would I would probably um, in nighttime lean more toward the um, Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 Pro. But um, let me know down below. If you enjoyed the video, I thank you guys for staying locked in with me and taking this trip with me as well and staying locked in. But make sure you hit the bell icon so you could check out the next video that is coming really soon. So uh, uh, make sure you stay tuned for that. And if you're new, welcome to the crew. Um, but hit that like button if you found this video informative, helpful or even in the least entertaining. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.